After years in the repair shop, the world's most complex machine is coming out of hibernation. Scientists are hitting the restart button on the Large Hadron Collider. Straddling the French-Swiss border, what's been called the Big Bang Machine, consists of a 17-mile underground ring. There, subatomic particles travel at almost the speed of light and are smashed together, allowing scientists to sift through the aftermath in an attempt to answer unsolved questions about things like dark matter, supersymmetry, and extra dimensions. The LHC is a science experiment that took decades to come together. The first official recognition came in 1984. During a workshop, staff at CERN, the European Organization for Nuclear Research, discussed what types of particles to smash together. But it took 10 years before the construction of LHC was approved. Before sign-off was even given, one major part of the project was already in place. That 17-mile tunnel needed to get particles moving at incredible speeds. It was already being used by a different accelerator that would later be decommissioned. Building the rest of the facility that would make up the LHC took years. There were complications, including a delay because 4th century ruins were found during excavation. The LHC was finally up and running in 2008. For the first time, a beam of protons steered around the collider, but it wasn't a smooth start. Nine days later, an electrical problem damaged the machine. About one year and $40 million in repairs later, the machine was back online and the payoff was colossal. In 2012, CERN announced the discovery of the elusive Higgs boson, the so-called guard particle, thought to explain how other particles get their mass. But the following year, the $10 billion proton collider was taken offline for refurbishing. Now, it's being fired up again. This run is due to go through 2017. With the upgrades, particles can collide together at even higher energies, giving scientists another chance to unlock the mysteries of our universe.